everybody. Joe Chaffee here, Weather in a Minute, on this Thursday, the 11th of December. And coming up tonight on the Joe and Joe Weather Show podcast, we're going to talk about maybe the chance for a little bit of snow over the weekend for eastern Pennsylvania to southern New England, uh, southward down uh, through New Jersey and into Maryland and Delaware. Uh, meteorologist Dave Tolleris will be jump- coming in on tonight also to talk about the long range, see where we're going over the next couple of weeks. This morning, uh, the backside of this storm system and cold front that went through yesterday. So we do have uh, lake effect snows going on. Uh, we still have some uh, blizzard warnings up for the mountains of West Virginia and Western Maryland. And that probably lasts uh, for a little while longer before they come down this afternoon. Uh, winter storm warnings in parts of north central New York, lake effect snow warnings in southwestern New York and parts of northwestern Pennsylvania. And then you see this stripe of winter weather advisories uh, running from southern West Virginia uh, into western North Carolina, and that goes northwestward uh, all the way back up into the northern plains, uh, where we have even a few winter storm warnings uh, up in parts of uh, Montana. Uh, this is uh, basically, you follow that line, we're getting these disturbances that are coming in from off the Pacific uh, that are going to be moving along over the next couple of days. Meanwhile, today, we've got the wind machine working again. Uh, and actually, we have wind advisories up for parts of Massachusetts and Connecticut. Uh, the gradient is fairly tight. We'll probably have gusts up above 30 miles an hour for a good portion of the day, which uh, means temperatures uh, that'll top out in the upper 30s and low 40s are going to feel that much colder, uh, maybe about, about 10 degrees or so uh, with that gusty wind. Uh, satellite loop doesn't show a whole lot going on. We do have patchy clouds, especially once you move inland and you get involved in that lake effect. There's an upper trough here that's swinging eastward. Uh, and then we uh, go back further west, and here's all that Pacific energy that continues to come in to the Pacific Northwest and then diving down uh, along in the plains. So we're thinking for a Saturday night, later Saturday night into the first part of Sunday, that we're probably going to see some snow. In the meantime, it's cold and mostly dry. Uh, the uh, snow to the southwest dries up. Friday looks okay. So does Saturday. Uh, we'll probably start to cloud up later in the day Saturday. And here comes this fast-moving system on an Arctic boundary. We'll probably see some snow uh, break out uh, during Saturday night into the first part of Sunday morning. And I'm thinking this is looking like a one to three to at most two to four inch type situation with the highest amounts of snow probably as you head to the south.